It is well. It is well. It is well. We must have Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Jesus. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, cover my husband, cover my family, his family, yes, Lord. In the name, in the name, it is well, it is well. Yes, the enemy, fire, 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 it is well, it is well, holy ghost, 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 cover my husband, cover his family, Holy Ghost, yes, Lord. It is well in my soul. It is well. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. Fire, 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 fire. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost. Yes, Lord. Yes, it is well. It is well. Honey, honey, let's pray. It is well. It is well. It is well. Cover my family. Cover his, my husband. Cover my husband. Cover my husband. Cover my family. It is well. It is well. It is well. I am free. Praise the Lord. I'm free. I'm no longer bound. No more shame. And Jesse Bella. Repent of your sins upon her, not even have her clothes. Jesus. Jesus. I can't put on clothes. You're not covered. You should cover your body. Look at me. You should cover it. Look at what is that what you're wearing. I'm, I'm seeing everything. Breast, breast, leg, and tie. Jesus. Repent, oh Jezebel. Repent. Every day I get up and play a drama song. Every day, every day, every day. Repent. And God, not like ugly. Repent. Repent. I Until 21 days. I'm going to sell cancer and something. I'm going to sell cancer and something. Repent, Mount Rue. Repent of your sins. Repent. 
God, he's not my Holy Ghost. Fire! Fire if you want to know. When I serve God, repent of your sins. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, fire. Well, Jezebel, them come up in the church in the pants and short shots and the whole wig. You see leg and tie. Repent. Repent, mother. Repent. Are you with that the cigarette? Try away. Try away. Repent. Repent. Come here to me. Come here. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. You should stop the smoking and stop the drinking. Come to church Sunday. Yes, spin, spin it all. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Fire! 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 Oh, clap, brother. God is good. God is good to me. How could I let him down? How could I let him down? How could I let him go? He's so good to me. Amen. 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 Make everybody hear, man. Say amen. God is good. God is good. God is good to me. How could I let him go? How could I let him go? Walking. No, make no sense. What is wrong with this mad woman? So I'll be seeing you at church tomorrow. Yes, ma'am. Bible said, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. You what? shall not be begging bread. Ask all when you give your life to Jesus. Honey, what the hell are you doing on the road? What I'm are you preaching, doing? brother. You can come and join me. Put on the car. What's up, man? I'm mad, somebody. So you're calling your wife a mad woman? You are behaving like a mad woman. So how am I preaching the gospel behaving like a mad woman? Listen, you, you, come, come in the car, come. No, come. no, no, the Holy Spirit is right anyhow. Hello, I said come in the, the car. The Holy Spirit is right anyhow, brother, go. Amen. Say amen. Come in the car. Amen, say amen. Amen. Oh, Spirit, I need to pray of that demon spirit of my husband. He's getting so stubborn. You need to be washed in the blood. Put on the car and come out here, so brother. Me I tell your body who my hell live next door me. Mm. Every day she get up, she pray. She pray, she pray, she pray a surfing husband. I mean, no, the man they uncomfortable sometimes. Mm. And she just pray before dear, night, morning, everything she does, she pray. Is that the same way that I She's same one. She's same one. Oh, God. She's same one. Same one. Every day, every day something. And not just one time. Every day she do it. She don't trouble you? Oh, God. She called me Jezebel. Oh, God. She said me now put on clothes. The mother sitting and I don't look on her. All the talk she attack, I don't look on her. Because my sister look like he head gone into holy. So what do your husband say about that? I'm oh, sorry for him. Every time I see your husband, I see him, I can see him on his face. So he's not happy, uncomfortable. Oh gosh, man, don't tell me. Yeah, that. man, he's uncomfortable. And Ingo does not even give him wife. And she had a man spinning in the road. Yes. Spinning in the road. Mm -hmm. I know so the man just do it because he have to do it. I know what she no, feel no, no way. Man. A regular thing she do it, man. Every time she do it. So how many times when me hear him afraid for going out, me close them because of she. No, you gonna make it stop your family. Oh God, yes. Jesse Bell, repent. And what do you think about that? You don't oh, think you need to repent? No, you know. Me not ready for repent yet. Oh, she a go on, she make me no one go go repent. Mm -mm. No don't way. Like mm -mm. Don't come out like she at all, at all, at all. She make it look like say I want hard sin for do. She just uh, every day and she have one back last prayer. Every minute she's prayer. I wonder if I catch me she have been a hit as prayer. Me prayer. Don't make that touch you. Don't touch me at all. 
Je spray pas mes amis quand on spray mes agents on nous comme bombe pop bombe pop mes skin. What kind of spray it is? I don't know what kind of spray, but me know some white sit now come out. Mm. Be careful. Yes. Be real careful. Mm hmm. But me feel like say you feel say your husband are going to be Hmm. I wonder. And if you do it, she getting on crazy, so he might as well. Yes, and if you do it, I don't blame him. I want him to call look me. Huh? Yes. You want to look for the girl who's born? Yes. Him not, she not deserve him. A good looking fella? Yes, she not deserve him. I would like to see him too. Mm -hmm. yeah, and he drive to him. No? Serious? Yes, I want to go in the car for the car. I just cock up my foot. Then punish me. Yes. You go ahead. Do you yeah. think? Yes. Do you think so the church girl will have the Jezebel in you? Okay. Mm -hmm. See you there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like that. Ah. It's such a long, stressful day of work. This mad woman, the fire, but she approved. I was like, come on, give me some front chair on top, but she had preached from the road. The whole night she had me up last night, but she had a ninth, and she had a lick, and she had a thump, and she had a kick. Oh, hello. Hello. Good evening. Oh. You're... I can sit and talk. You're Michelle, right? Yes, I am. Wow. Hmm. You can have a seat here. Yeah, I would, yeah, but I, I would love to talk to you alone, if that's possible. I can sure. Just talk to you alone. Sure. Hmm? Go ahead. Sure. Come here, man. Come here. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Come here. 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 Well, our church is on fasting, so automatically oh it's like me after on fasting, so. Oh my. It's just ridiculous, you understand? I feel your pain. But I would love to get to know you, though. Sure, I'm here. Next door. <laughs> I'm sitting down talking to this Jezebel. Excuse me. Jezebel? Look at her. She don't even want no clothes. Holy ghost. Excuse me. She don't even no. want any clothes. You, you need to stop this madness right now. What, what you doing? Stop it. I need to pray this demon out of you. Get up and go inside. Listen. You know what? I'm not going to him this drama. This is drama. Excuse me. Put on clothes on Jezebel. <laughs> Listen, let, let me let, no, listen, let me explain something to you. I am a man. I'm not a man too, and I'm not a mannequin. I am a man. I am your husband. Holy ghost. And the same Bible here yeah, I read every day and say you have to respect your husband. Fire. So I'm not going to sit Fire. here and stand here and make you talk to me like me and sound like a picnic. Fire. As a matter of fact, my hungry, so I'm going to find something give me for eat right now. Well, I'm fasting. Come on, Prefuse, man. What is going on? I need to pray on this demon. <laughs> Exhausting day, man. And I oh, be honey. To the All right, can, can we just put down this for tonight? Can, can we do something else different? Can we just, you know, um, kind of in a mood, you understand? No, but I'm praying. I'm praying. I'm praying. Can I pray at that boat? Whiter than snow. Oh. Whiter. Jesus. Fire. Fire. Holy Ghost fire. In Jesus' name. Come, let's pray, husband. Come, let's pray. Wednesday night, you had all night prayer meeting all by yourself. I'm fasting. Thursday night, 
you keep me up because you pray down the hole. I don't know what you're praying for or praying about, but you keep me up for the whole night. Tonight, me come and I want a little something and you are going to tell me about pray. No, don't say that way. When the Bible says pray without ceasing, I know that's it I talk about. The Bible says be fruitful and multiply a time for the multiplication. No, 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 we don't mm -hmm. have to multiply. Jesus. Holy Ghost. Let's pray, honey. Come, let's pray. Let's pray. Let's pray. We have to pray out this demon in here. We have to pray out all this demon. This the demon only is. demon within you are you. By the way, I realize if I'm weak, you're not going to shut. What happened? You say I'm out evangelizing. Winning so, souls for the kingdom. So let, let me get this straight. Because maybe I'm not having no sense. Mm. So you lock up the shop. They put on road every Point day. Correction. I sell out everything. And give it some to the your, church. Sell out your, sell out, sell, I sell burn out. the rum. That is not of God. I burn it. You burn do what? it. You, no, hold on. Maybe, no, hold on. Wait, hold on. You, you do what? What? I you, sell out some of the things I'm going to give some to the church. <laughs> But the rums and the cigarettes that you have in the shop have burned them. That is not of God. That is of the devil. This is why I said we need to pray out the devil out of this house. The only person we have to come out of this house are you. I'm not because moving. you I'm are not going moving. I'm standing you. firm in God. You are I'm telling me. Moving. You are telling me the man that works so hard to put food on our table. That you have so no 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 because it seems like you are reading your Bible back here. So let me give you a scripture every day. No, let me give you a scripture to meditate upon. The Bible said by the sweat of your brow you should eat bread. You know what that means? That you should work to get whatever it is that you need. The Bible also said you should pray every day. I'm going fasting for your soul to grow. You, you know, I'm getting all sick. Your sins away. I'm getting sick and tired of being sick and tired of your bullshit. Because this is complete. Don't say that Let's pray. Before I get myself into trouble for you, I'm going to leave. Where are you leaving to? I'm going oh to God, leave. Oh God, the devil is standing continue, right here. Continue your prayer. Continue your prayer. <laughs> I'm going home. You can you can get a lift from. You don't have to walk. Anyways, Michelle, I'm so sorry for the way that my crazy I don't even know. It's like she have a mental problem ever since she started going to church and she says she gets saved, like Last night she told me that she burned up the whole of the goods in the shop and sell where she sell and oh carry the money to get past the church. Really? Wow. I asked her if it's on sex, she tell me say she want to pray. Like, wow. Every wow. night is the same thing. I don't thing. know how you cope with that lady. I don't know. Well, I'm, I'm, I told her, I'm tired of her. Last night, I'm not even sleeping in the room. I just was sleeping at the city because... She is like she get on top of my nerves to be oh honest. Oh my god. You know I'm next door and I was I was like, oh my god. I'm so depressed. I don't know what 
this woman just get up and him pray and him pray and him pray and him pray. When he see me call me Jezebel, it, I don't know. Honestly, to how she be, she had a Jezebel. So don't take offense when you hear she make her noise. Cause it, 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 it just doesn't make any sense to me. But I think she needs to change. If she don't change, someone holds out her word. Really, I go come in our life. That's a very good idea. Yes. And that's what I was thinking when I saw you in the sexy tights. I said, this is somebody that I want to be in my life. Oh my. I can't take the knives. I can't take every minute get up and pray. Every minute get up and fasting. I like, never tell us I want to go and fasting. I if you're in your church and they're fasting, no go on, leave me out of it. How many days I've had to go on the road and buy breakfast because she decides, all right, she not cook nothing, give me, I'm late for work, so I can't stand up and cook it for myself. Yeah. But that I can't take too much time for do. Mm -hmm. But I was thinking, though, that, you know, she go, on, she go to fasting service on Tuesdays. Oh, and I'm available. I'm going to call in sick. Sure. So I would love for you That's to come over. Idea. I would love for you to come over. What's the next thing? Mm. You sure come over to your house? Yeah, man. You can and come that over. crazy lady come yeah, and man. catch us. She now she 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 is so in in love with with our God and this fasting. She behaves so holy, like she had Jesus herself. So she now go leave church for, until church finish three o'clock. She okay. now go leave church. And if the house are burned down, she now go leave church. So you don't need okay. to worry about that. Well, if I'm not to worry about that then, we're good to go. This again. Why you have this jersey baby in your car? Because she looking like she coming from the club. We need to repent. Back to the center. We're not doing this again. We're not having this conversation. Why did you have this jersey baby in your car? I saw her walking. And if you were truly a good Christian, as you claim to be, you would have no problem with me giving our no, neighbor not even wearing any clothes. giving our neighbor a lift because the rain looked like to go fall and I saw her walking. All I did was give her a lift home. What's the problem? Mm -mm. No man, somebody 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 changing my husband mind from Christ. We're not having this conversation. <laughs> No, we are not what, having this. Listen, no, I slept in the coach. This last. is not my I slept I in do. the coach last Jesus. night. I will sleep in the coach again. We're not having this conversation. You're getting on my nerves. Holy Ghost, pray up. What? Pray up. have to pray up, please. Pray it off. <sighs> We're not doing it today. We're not doing it. <sighs> No man, this is not my husband. All this girl wearing all of them clothes coming from bad club come to call my husband by mine. Not working. I'm waiting for you this week in here. You better come back in the house so we're praying. Boy, you don't know what my husband. My husband changed. Like them corporate men not working, stop go to church and stop prayer. Him stop with Bible. I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. Him just not even touch me anymore. Him not even sleep in the bed no more. 
Okay, is it something that you did that caused him not to come in bed with you anymore? And not go to church? Well, we, I do a lot of fasting and praying. Okay, and in this fasting and praying, what are some of the requirements for that? I want you to fast and pray with me. Okay, I understand that. But what are the requirements of the fasting? To build our marriage life, run out all demons from out of our house, and all the Jezebel that is coming around my husband. Okay, so are you cooking for him? No, or do you want fasting? Fasting. Are you having sex with him? No, can't be fasting and having sex. Are you taking care of the household? Don't have time for that one. All right. So that is where the problem comes in. Sometimes we as women have to look at ourselves and to look at some of the things, whether we fasting or not. Now, yes, you are Christian. Yes, you want to acknowledge and keep up the fasting. But in doing that, you need to remember, one, you are fasting. And when fasting, you are fasting for yourself to build a connection with your mighty God. Yeah, you don't need to drag or force anybody into anything. And in doing that, you need to ensure that you cook for your husband, although he's not fasting, you need to cook for him. And you don't even have to do a whole day fast. You can do a six to six, where, you know, after six, you can probably at least caress and find out how his day was after work. And you don't have to be so hard on him. Also, I saw you the other day, in the, in the streets and you had a man spinning and these kind of things and honestly speaking as a Christian woman there are values that we have to upkeep and that kind of loud and extravagant behavior that is not like a Christian woman now can I share a scripture with you? Yes. I have a scripture here I can share with you seeing that you are going through so much in, the, in, in your life right now and you're trying to find yourself in God, let me just give you one piece of advice. It came from Proverbs 14 verse 1. And I'm reading from the King James Version. It reads, Every wise woman buildeth her house, but the foolish pluck it down with her hands. So, to further I reiterate on this verse that I just read here, it basically means you build your own house and you can also destroy it. So yes, you have had your family and your husband and you guys are good. I'm sure you guys had a wonderful, perfect beginning. Now, because you have chosen to follow God, yes, you're doing the right thing, but in, the, in a different manner. You have to be mindful. And if you are uncertain about something, read your word. Read your word, don't just go out there and there's a typical saying that says, ladies must be seen and not heard. You ever heard about that before? Of course. So being out there in the streets and being extravagant and loud, don't you think that is not Christian life? So you need to check within yourself. Check within yourself. See, what are my values? What am I doing wrong for my husband to... And he's always complaining about my dressing and all that. Oh. So you see, how do you dress when you go out there? Cover up, cover up everything. Yes, yes, you're covered. Yes, it's good to cover yourself, but is it the old granny type of covering? No, man, not because you're a Christian means that you have to look that down and old how you can dress decently and still cover everything up. Sometimes I've got a man just want to see his woman and forehead over heels in love with her again. Not because you are so comfortable in the relationship means that you would neglect yourself and just go down an old man. You say, no, you're young and you're beautiful. You can show off your beauty. Let your husband see that, hey, my wife, my wife is so beautiful. Let him fall in love with you again. Take my stupid advice. And try thinking about yourself. Try looking inner. And try to treat him a different way. Treat him with more love and compassion. Rub his feet when he comes home. Look, and you will see a difference. Oh, right. You will see a difference. Thank yeah? you for that, Tyler. Thank you. You're most welcome. Thank I hope I'm back. God is with you all the time. He's with you all the time, and He sees your effort. You just have to remember you have to love your neighbor as you love yourself.
Yeah, and there's a neighbor here in our door. She don't dress properly. You know? She always wearing this like chest is not your concern. concern. Yeah, that is not your concern because God comes to judge everyone for themselves. He's not going okay. to judge her for you, I mean, but he's going really to judge you for her. Yeah, you tell them what you read, show them, give them proof. Show them from the Bible. If you want to correct someone, show them from the Bible. Yeah, and let they choose. Give them the option to choose for themselves. Okay. Yeah? Okay, thank you. Please, well. I hope to hear better reviews next time you come to check me. Huh? Yeah. Try again to look within yourself and see where you are going wrong. And don't be afraid to apologize. Switch it up a bit. Yeah? Sister, I love you. <laughs> you. Thank you. Okay, that's new. What happened? So you don't want to have any more things? Okay. Okay. That's also new. <laughs> yes. Okay. Well, I prepared some food for you. Food? Yes, food. I'm not done fasting today. Okay. <laughs> Three times a charm. Oh, yeah. mm. Anything else? Anything that I should be worried about? Any more surprises? Because this is surprising to me. And I'm sorry for acting all, you know, loud and, you know, what? Don't you really forgive me? Okay. Uh, you're not forgiving yet, but. No, it's a start. It's a start. Yeah, so what, what brought about this sudden change? What happened? Yeah. All right, so I met a lady while mm. I was ministering outside. Mm -hmm. And um, she was there talking to me and telling me that's not the way how Christian like behavior and I should treat my husband much better. And, it's not wrong for me to be a Christian, but the way how I do it, yeah. I should always take care of my family, take care of my house, and she quote a scripture from Proverbs telling me I think I was doing it the wrong way, and I should also love my neighbor, and I should not be discriminating others, and you know, I am sorry about that. And my bedroom life, my that's something I've been waiting to hear for a very long time. Mm. I'm sorry about that and I think I I am ready to change now. And I need to start a family with you. I'm getting older. Mm. I need to have my little kids running up and down now. So yeah. Wow. All this time you've been praying. Mm. And so I decided that I needed to pray too. And I pray that God would send somebody just to show you the right way. And God has answered my prayers. So I'm happy for the change. Like I said, you're not forgiven just yet. But at least this is a start. Okay. I'm so happy that things are not the way they used to be. And I pray that they will never go back to the way they were. Okay, husband. Never. Wow. As God give me grace, I run this race until I hear my Savior face to face.
heart in the grave I'll run this race Until I see my Savior Oh,